what is going on punk nation and welcome back to another video today we got a very special video we are sitting on uh, Midwest horizon for a reason and this is the punk Dylan server so this is the server for the channel um, we I just started it it is not running on my friend's PC at the moment but I figure I'm gonna pop the PC up we got let's see we got me uh, dread which I've met from another server and then we got two other people so we got four people and I figure maybe five or six farms give or take there is a ton of farms so we're just gonna go quick and drive around so you have a farm right here next to your shop I've already played with a bunch of people so I kinda know how they set it up they put a shop like right here so but I'm just gonna talk about the uh, server a little bit so we're gonna have at least four main farms running uh, when, when you're the boss um, these four guys including me obviously we're gonna be our own boss to our own farm but I am the main boss over the entire server. So basically, thing is this as a big corporation, and we're trying to make a bunch of crops. So I think my home base is going to be down by 34, about in the center of the map there by um, 116. I did that on the other server that I was joining. Um, news about that that one uh, got kicked for no random reason uh, he did uh, make a big mistake and this is where I want to talk about it um, the four farmers that are farming this land um, are going to be in a group chat so if I have to make a decision like um, this will never come up but let's say my friend can't pay for electricity to run the server we need to go host a server so money needs to be drawn out which that will never happen. Something like that. If something comes up in the server, them four guys will be notified so that no progress is lost. Because what I experienced was I put in a lot of hours into that particular server and lost it all. Like, I was working on 108, coming here up on the right, just about to be done, and I was making plans. I needed to do a whole bunch of stuff. And then I get kicked off the server for no apparent reason. Lost my farm. He uh, took the the number of players down to six people. We were running a 12-player server. And funds were not coming in, apparently, and he needed money. He never spoke to us. He never spoke to the farmers and said, Hey, would you guys want to chip in and help with the server? So I pledged to always... You know, something like, obviously, we don't have to pay money for this server. It's gifted from Mike. You guys have known him. We did a server in 17. So, that's never going to happen. But if we were renting a server from one of those sites, it would. So, and that's just, that's not on your guys' end, but that's for the farmers so that they don't feel like they're just wasting their time. Their time is always going to be valued on the server. And then how it's going to work for you guys that are just helpers you are able to join any farm under any circumstances you're able to join my farm dreads farm and all the other two guys um, you know you have to follow their rules make sure you're doing something and then they're allowed to kick you at any reason uh, they don't have to give me a reason why they kicked you so I'm not gonna mess with that oh he said she said what you're just going to be real about it and I want real farmers, real helpers. You know, no messing around, no flying across the map. Crop destruction will be off, but play like it is on. I don't want people to lose crops because of idiots. So as we look here, there is plenty of farms. You can build farms off of this road. And my farm is actually gonna be down this road. I took the long way, there's actually a shorter way. But I played on the other server with this farm and it's been a really nice server you're kind of exclusive you're boxed in by all these fields nobody really bothers you because the other farm I would have liked to have is over by on the other side of the map actually I think it was yeah by 69 
So you basically get all this land, but there's actually, I used this land over here. It's kind of tight, but I put in a big shed right behind the house. So it kind of sucks I couldn't live stream it from it. I was just getting, you know, friendly with everybody. I just didn't want to shove in their face, oh, we're going to start live streaming right away. But now I own my own server, and I'm the boss. So that is better suiting for me. So hope you guys enjoyed today's little video. Um, I will let you guys know when it's officially up to the public, but right now uh, Mike's having trouble with the server. It's just little problems. Just got to make sure it acts well and behaves. So once it's finally public, I'll be streaming hopefully Saturdays, maybe throughout the week. Um, everybody post down in the comments below when you are free, and let's see when we can stream. We'll see when our schedules meet up. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. Have a great day, and we'll see you guys later. Peace.